Yay! <laughs> Part four of a four-part series was only supposed to be one part. Sorry, you guys are probably going, I'm going to kill this guy. Take his fucking bug out bag. Uh, but in case you didn't see any of the three parts before this part, it's www.everythingsurvivalist.com. And on YouTube, it's your survival channel. All right, so we're, I mean, there's only like a couple items left. Uh, this is for Poison Ivy. Mm -hmm. I have to quite a bit of those, too. If you ever had Poison Ivy, you're going to want some kind of relief. Trust me. I've had that shit on my balls. I've had it everywhere, <laughs> and it sucks. Then we got what everybody should have, at least, you know, a compass. You know, just in case, you know, something happens, your electronics don't work, you might want a compass. Liquid compasses are the best. Um, this one is a... Is that liquid? No, no, no. It's liquid. No, it's not. It is? Yeah, look at it. It's floating. <laughs> no, it's like the honey badger. <laughs> and I got a little signal mirror in here in case I want to do a little signaling. Hey, come over. Let's have some tequila. Yeah. And some smokes. And smokes. Yeah. <laughs> camp soap. In case those little camp wipes ain't doing it for your dirty balls. <laughs> Can opener. Everyone's got to have one of these. You can get these things like the military store. I mean, it's so light really and small. Cheap, yeah. You can open a can with that, you know. You could come down to like, that's all you come across is a can of fucking something. You can't get it open, man. You're going to be <laughs> uh, Here's another little piece of cable. Whatever. And I think, other than the sleeping bag in the tent that's at the bottom of this bag, there's also, I, I also have a hammock. A hammock in there. I don't like the, the hammock. I actually have a really kick-ass hammock, um, and I don't sleep in it. It, it. it drives me crazy. I can't sleep bent. I'm old. I'm angry. So I, get, I put that in my kid's backpack. Um, <laughs> they get old and angry, too. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. On the straps up here, I have, uh, you can get one of these waterproof cases. Your phone. This, yeah, this, my iPhone fits perfect in this. And... You know, if my phone still works for making phone calls, great. If it doesn't, the reason I carry that phone is because I have so many apps on it for medical, for survival tools, all kinds of crazy stuff on that thing. You can use your solar power <clears throat> to charge it, too. I can charge it with my solar power. I can take pictures. I can listen to my music. But mainly, I, I got those apps on there. I mean, so I don't care if I don't have a phone to, like, call people because I have those apps. And then, uh, you know, there's, I got a, a, oh, a first show on the iPhone here. But we're going to go over weapons on one of the next videos. So that's all for the backpack. Uh, I'm going to need a drink of water and some oxygen after all that talking. Hope, uh, hope this, <laughs> I hope this helped you out. I'm also going to be putting a list of main things that I think that should be uh, in your bag or survival things that you should have. So stay tuned for that. And write some comments and below. this is Chris and Christian. Chris's hippie friend Christian <laughs> saying so long from EverythingSurvivalist.com and your survival channel on YouTube and I want to give a big shout out to the guy behind the camera my good buddy what's his name Austin oh, Austin my good best friend Austin thanks buddy <laughs> all right don't forget to like and favorite bye bye <laughs>